It's Maze from Real Social Dynamics. Welcome to Times Square. And what we're about to jump into right now is a free tour on gratitude. Appreciating where you are right now and all the milestones that you've hit that you may not even realize have made an impact on your DNA, on your blueprint. All those milestones that you hit that like, you don't even, you don't realize how much you've grown. Like take, st like stop, take a second, reflect all the things that you've been through and who you are as a person because of those milestones that you hit. So we're about to jump into that right now. Who here is like in their first year of finding out, finding out about this content? Epic, epic shit. Like, I'm sure your world's like turned upside down. Cause it was for me, like my whole world flipped. And it's, it's awesome because once you're getting bombarded with all these different perspectives, like this whole new world, like life is so rich. Every day is a, f a totally new experience. You feel every cell in your body. It's awesome. It's so awesome because everything's new. Everything's new. Every the, the way you perceive the world is like switched. It's epic. So, so, so epic. Like you could, everything, every single thing you, you did, everything you do when you wake up, every day you remember. Like, it, like it's its own world. Phenomenal, phenomenal. Welcome to a whole new world, guys. <laughs> I welcome you. Straight up. Straight up. Seriously, like, I, I think we, we take for granted how awesome it is to even know about this content. Just to know about it. I'm sure a lot of you aren't even taking action on the shit that you know, but just, I mean, definitely take action, but just to know about it, just to have a context for where you are in your life and everything that's going on, your, your shortcomings, your successes, to have a context for what that is and to choose where you're going, that's, it's a blessing. Like, we're, we're the minority, guys. We really are. And you gotta wake up every day and appreciate that. We forget that, we take it for granted. I take it for granted. Like, I've come a long way since I've come, since I found out about RSD and like even this past week, I was talking to Tyler or Owen, however, whatever you call him. <laughs> and it's like, yo, like, it's so, it's been six years. I found out when I was, about RSD when I was 16, I'm 22 now. And I legit take for granted all these milestones that I've, I've hit. I'm like, I look back, I'm like, yo, where did this, these six years go? And then you, you like, I, I get to share all these experiences and it's just crazy. It's crazy. It's dope, man. <laughs> I know, I'm just, I'm, I'm just so, I'm so grateful. I'm grateful for you guys. I'm grateful for you too. <laughs> yes. It's, it's awesome. Um, you know, like, when I, I, I didn't expect to instruct. It was never my goal. I just wanted to get around the crew and to soak up all the juices. You know? <laughs> all, of it, all of it, you know? And, cause like I, I, say it, I say this all the time, you, half of all your goals is the people you surround yourself with. So I just wanted to surround myself with, with Owen, with Julian, with the entire team, with the marketing team, everybody. Everybody has things to share in RSD and we're just a, we're a unit, it's awesome. And as I was going through my internship, I, I just, I, was, I asked Owen like straight up, like uh, where do you think this is going? Where, where do you see me, you know, <laughs> going with this, with the company? And he's like, I think you should instruct. With that, with that voice, I think you should, I think you should <laughs> That's what I see for you. I'm like, ah, cool, um, great. I'm not opposed to it. Obviously, I think it would be awesome. I always thought about it. I actually led a lot of inner circles before I even started working with RSD. I, I, I led inner circle Kissimmee or slash Orlando, Miami, and then Atlanta was the last one I ran. And then I might take up uh, LA soon. 
Um, so I had some experience working with, with RSD, you know, um, but I never anticipated to instruct. And it's a total, total blessing to be able to share my experiences with you guys and to share all these lessons that I've learned. And like, there's, it, I feel like being a teacher in any, in any way is so fulfilling. To see you guys grow right in front of me is, is amazing. If you ever have the, a, a chance to teach somebody else what you're learning, always, always, always execute on that. It is the most fulfilling thing you can do. Teachers are the backbone of our society, straight up. Anything that you have expertise in, not only is it, is it good for the person that you're sharing with, but it's amazing for you. You learn so much faster when you are teaching. My growth has been exponential this year because I teach what I, I've learned. So, so, so key. Anything, anything, it doesn't matter what it is. Teach somebody else what you are an expert in or what you're trying to learn. You'll learn that much faster. Is happiness worth it if it compromises achievement? Uh, well, it, it comes down to you, right? Uh, it's your life. I can't really make that decision for you. What is most important? Like I just said, you, we're at a point in our evolution where we can choose what we want to do with our lives. We can choose our values. We're not just put into a system and we need to do our job. Like what is most important to you? Is it money or you, do you just want to be happy? Is that happiness uh, just fluff? Are you lying to yourself? Is it, tr is it genuine happiness based off of genuine work that you've put in? Or do you, do you just want to buckle for a few years and grind it out, slave away, <laughs> and make shit happen. Like, it, it just depends on you. I think there's, I think there's a balance that everybody can find. Uh, I work my ass off. <laughs> um, I'm probably on like, I'm on like three hours of sleep right now. Um, inflamed to shit. My body feels like it's about to buckle. But, you know, I, I'm grateful, man. Like, this is awesome. I'm around people that I love to be around and you know, I, I still have fun. You can still have fun and work hard. Work hard, play hard. What's up, man? You just gotta reverse engineer. You gotta really, really, truly have a clear vision of what you want your life to look like. Do you wanna have fun? Do you wanna work hard? Maybe make like, the, the fun a reward or something. Say it again? Maybe, maybe make the fun like a reward for the hard work. Yeah. Like, to do, like, Gamify it, and then really like, structure out your day in a way that, or structure out your, your days, your weeks, your months in a way where you get to get it all in. You get to have the fun. You get to put in the work that will, will give you long-term success. But you need a clear vision of what you want first. If not, you're just kind of expecting things to play out. How can you get that vision? How can you get that vision? Um, experimenting. If you don't know what you want, experiment, experiment, experiment travel, just try different things. And people, like, don't feel as though you need to have the answers right now. That's so stupid. Like, there's people who are 40 that are just finding their life's purpose, 50, 60, that come onto our programs, that just, fi just, just figured it out. And it's cool. Experiment, enjoy that process. You don't need to have this idea, this, this purpose of what you want. And the, uh, the other thing, one of my biggest epiphanies this year was you don't need to wait to be motivated or to be inspired. If you just put in work, if you just take action, the inspiration, the motivation will come. Every day I'm more and more inspired and I feel that purpose in what I'm doing because I see the people that I'm impacting, because I see my potential in the areas and that can grow. It will come. Motivation, inspiration, action. And it's just a cycle. It doesn't need to start at any one of those. Take action, inspiration, motivation will come. So I hope you enjoyed that free tour on gratitude. I hope you appreciate where you are right now 
And that appreciation, that gratitude will propel you to take action on all your goals and your many successes to come. Much love, peace. Uh, uh. Ah, ah, ah. It all worked out.